We're here with heavyweight Joey DeWaco, who on September 19th at Harris, Philadelphia, will take on Johan Banks in the main event. Joey I boxing, uh, pelts boxing. Joey, what's happening? Oh man, just training hard, getting ready for the fight. I can't wait. Um, you had a big knockout, first round stoppage over David Williams in your last bout on August 2nd. Uh, what did that do for your confidence? Uh, it did a lot for my confidence because um, I was training hard and I'm training harder now, but it did a lot because I, I just went in there and I had the confidence to, to blow that guy out. So. Was that a carryover of the Rossi fight? You know, probably on paper your best win to date. Was that a, that confidence a carryover of that win? Beating Derek Rossi um, gave me a lot of confidence, actually. It kind of turned my career around because who knows what I would have been if I would have took on tougher fights and did did other things that I'm doing now, but um, it, it, it kind of was. You know, now that I, ha I have the confidence to go out there and, and do that to guys, you know. Now you're under the management club, 1957 management, Mark Ciperone. Again, you know, bringing more things to the table, I guess helping with your training, uh, giving you the proper stuff that you need to, to train most effective. Uh, is that all part of this as well? All of it, yeah, all of it. Mark is such a good manager. No other manager is doing what he's doing in boxing right now. He's just... He's a life changer, man, and it's great. Mark Ciparone is the best manager in boxing. I'll say it again for you. Johan Banks, a guy who's he's faced uh, some up-and-coming fighters. What can you tell us about him? Um, I don't know too much about him. I've seen one fight. Um, I really haven't really been able to study any tapes of him or anything, but I know he's a tough guy. I know he's big. Um, I know he's going to come to fight. He's not going to lay down, but um, I'm looking forward to the fight. I know it's going to be a, a tough test. A couple, win, couple more wins. Uh, I mean, yeah. where do you expect to be? I mean, it, obviously there were some, some draws, a couple losses in there. Where do you expect to be now? Do you feel all that is behind you, or do you still got the makeup for, for those? Um, with the with the Rossi win, I think it kind of it didn't erase it. It's always going to be there, but it, it, it put me on the right track. So I know that them them losses them draws i was taking them fights on short notice anyway not a lot of money involved with it but um it's it's a lot different now it's that, that's not going to happen anymore and i see myself in a few fights fighting 10 rounders you know what i mean stepping up trying to step up the competition every fight and uh hopefully be be in line and uh maybe a title shot along the lines anything you were saying closing just keep watching out for me i'm training hard